Hello there, my name's Anna and I work for Shropshire Museum's education team. Today we're in the Medieval and Tudor Gallery, which is housed in Vaughan's mansion. Vaughan was a person who earned such a lot of money selling woolen cloth and wine here in Shrewsbury. He had this wonderful building built and he would have loved this bed, which was built about 400 years ago. Not for him, but for the Corbett family. You can see their family symbol here up on the tester, which is a kind of roof for this four poster bed. The curtains here aren't original ones because fabric really doesn't last as long as wood. These have been made by volunteers in much more recent times. But the idea was that you could snuggle down in a little small cozy room, which would have been really handy in the cold castle that the Corbett's lived in. So draw the curtains, snuggle down in the bed, which is actually quite short. Now we all know that people in past times were a bit shorter than us, but the, the reason as well is that people believed in sleeping propped up, sitting up. And this was because lying down was associated with dying. So they obviously didn't want to get muddled in with that. So the bed is actually quite a springy and comfy one. It's basically, constructed on a wooden frame across which have been strapped pieces of rope. Sometimes it's leather straps and these are pulled tight so that the bed springs. Over time these loosen up a little bit and so the bed starts to sag so you just need to tighten the ropes and that's where we get the whole saying good night sleep tight from it's tightening those ropes. Then on top of that, there would be a rough mattress that would be stuffed with something like straw or hay. And for a poorer person who might be sleeping on the floor, for example, that mattress would certainly be enough. We actually get the phrase, hit the hay, meaning go to bed, from that kind of mattress set up there, stuffed with straw or hay. But for posh people, lying on scratchy hay wasn't really going to be okay. So they had a softer mattress on the top and that would be stuffed with wool or feathers, something soft like that. Then sheets on the top made of linen or silk and then some lovely cozy blankets made of wool or perhaps even fur. So you could snuggle down in this gorgeous bed, draw the curtains and go off to sleep. Night night, sleep tight.